What's up guys? Mike Garrick back with more high performance nutrition. What do we got for you tonight? We've got RFBs. Now what in the hell is an RFB? Rescue food bag. I'm going to show you guys how you can completely eliminate the excuse of not eating good. Now one of the number one excuses why people don't eat good is because of time. And really it's because of lack of, of preparation. So if you can take the time and learn how to make RFBs and you can take these things and you can stash them all over the place. You can put them in your, I have them in my gym bag, I have them in my trunk, I have them at work, you can have them in your locker, in your office, your diaper bag, I mean you name it. You can have them all over the place. And all they are is a little bag full of food and I'm going to show you what's in a couple of mine and give you some examples. But the thing about it is if you can get to the point where you incorporate this system into your daily systems, it's going to make life a heck of a lot easier. Now take a look at these examples right here. This one right here is basically self-contained and it's a Ziploc bag with other Ziploc bags in it with a bunch of different foods in it. And just like anything else, you want to have a balance here. So I always have, obviously I always have protein. So I'm in here, I've got pink salmon and tuna packets. Now these things come in amazing, delicious flavors. So it's not like you have to gag it down anymore and you can just tear it open. You don't even need a can opener. I also have a little uh, extra little baggies in there that you can put the salmon or tuna wrappers in and throw them in the garbage so you don't piss people off. And of course I have water and an apple for my carbs. And I choose an apple because an apple actually can stay in a bag like this for quite a while before it goes, it goes bad. Um, you can also put some other types of uh, carbs in there that aren't so um, perishable. But if you look here, I've got my, um, my good fats. I've got some almonds there. So this pack right here, this is about a thousand calories. So if you had two of these, that's basically your full day's worth of calories that you can take and put in a gym bag or in the trunk of your car or wherever. And you can have a bunch of these made up and you can just drop the apple in there so it's not sitting in there, you know, keep them in your fridge and you can be ready to go. Now, take a look at this one. This one's a little bit more incognito. It looks like a old whey protein container. But if you look inside, I have, I keep this one in my trunk. I have a funnel and a scoop, right, to scoop in anything out extra. Those are kind of tools. I have some um, portable utensils there that I get, you know, stuff basically leftovers from a restaurant. But I've got pure dextrose. This stuff doesn't need to be refrigerated. That's sugar. And I've got uh, protein powder. And, and then, of course, I've got my packages of, of almonds that have already been packed. Um, you know, every serving size has been individually separated out. So this right here is a quarter of a cup. And so I know exactly already how many, how many is in here. It's about 25 almonds. So as you guys can see, it's very simple. Take this and just use this to spark your creativity and create your own. Look, guys. Take the stress out of knowing where your next meal is coming from by building some RFBs and stash them all over the place. Hope this helps. I'm Mike Garrick, helping you think, eat, and move with a purpose. Welcome to the future.